joined on the phone right now by Texas Representative John Culberson, who represents the 7th District, Harris County. And tell me what's going on there in your district, Representative. Well, Trish, right now the uh, two main reservoirs on the west side of uh, Houston in my district, Attucks and Barker, uh, are, uh, are full. The Attucks Reservoir is so full that water is beginning to come around the spillway uh, in an uncontrolled way, which will increase the amount of flooding, ter the terrible flooding we've already experienced. So it's important for people to, uh, to get good information from official sources, like the Harris County Flood Control District website, uh, but Trish, also Texans are stepping up to help each other, and I would encourage people if they're uh, concerned about flooding, if they think that they need to be rescued, they can download, if they have access to the Internet, they should download an app called Next Door, which is uh, very, very useful. My brother Chris and his wife just had to be evacuated from their home in Fleetwood, and I want to thank uh, Sharon and Kenny Evans, their neighbors, Using next door, my brother just logged on. We've got next a picture, door. actually, uh, Congressman, right now of your brother there getting rescued, uh, that the viewers yeah. can see, and this is just that, a, a wonderful example again of neighbor helping neighbor. Absolutely, and that's the, the the beauty of social media and of free people. This is done entirely on their own initiative. Uh, his neighbors, uh, Sharon and Kenny Evans, organized this on next door so if people listening to this show download and they're in houston and they feel like they may need help or to be uh, evacuated down if they can get to the internet download next door log on create an account for free sign into your neighborhood and christopher just logged on and said we've got water in the first floor we need to be evacuated uh, uh his neighbor uh kenny evans showed up immediately with that boat and evacuated chris and his wife and their oh, dog yes, uh took mm -hmm. them took them to the edge of the neighborhood, and volunteers and monster trucks were lined up, just like cabs at the airport, and Chris just jumped into a truck, and the guy said, where do you need to go? And he took Chris to a nearby hotel and dropped him off, and our brothers now and his wife are safe uh, in a nearby hotel, but this is all done by volunteers, free people. Uh, they're using their own free will, uh, unlike a crowd yeah. crowd, sort of crowdsourcing, we're crowd-saving fellow Texans, Neighbors helping neighbors, Texans helping Texans, and I just can't say enough uh, about our first responders. We thank all of them for all their hard work, and the character of Texans is really shining forth Indeed. in this horrible episode. We're all helping each other, yeah. and it's going to be a team effort for all of us to recover from this. And a picture there of, of someone holding what I, I thought uh, may have been a baby, and then you see these children, and you know, it, it's going to be very traumatic uh, for all of these people, especially these kids, for sure. So there's there's a lot of work that's going to have to be done, Representative. We appreciate you being here. In some ways, this is all just beginning. Thank you very much. It is much. just beginning. We are close. We're getting hopefully okay. towards the end of it, but there's a lot of work to be done. We're going to do it together okay. and recover Good. from this. Good. We'll be right back.